Hello and welcome back to Road Trivia, the once a day road trip trivia quiz. Today's episode is day number 298 of the 365 day trivia road trip. Today's quiz comes all the way from Surf City, North Carolina. Submitted by Carlene and Bill Bear, we've got a 21 question random knowledge trivia quiz. There's going to be 20 questions up front, and then at the end of the episode, there's a question 21 tiebreaker if you need it. Stick around for that. Question number one. Question number one. The world's fourth largest island lies between latitudes 12 and 26 degrees south, with the nearest mainland state being Mozambique. What is this island where the ring-tailed lemur along with over 100 other species of lemur, can be found. The answer is Madagascar. Question number two. Someone suffering from this irrational fear can expect to experience a very high amount of anxiety just from thinking about trees. What is the term, originating from the Greek language, that is a primordial terror linked to the sense that trees are more alive than we think? The answer is dendrophobia. Question number three, Hippocrates is credited with being the father of this branch of mathematics, concerned with the relationship of angles and ratios. What is this field of mathematics that emerged during the third century BC? The answer is trigonometry. Question number four. This pugilist nicknamed The Real Deal and The Warrior was the WBA, WBC, and the IBF boxing champion during 1990 to 1992. Then again, WBA and IBF champion from 93 to 94. He also had a third championship reign for WBA and IBF during 1996 and 1997. Who is this boxer? The answer is Evander Holyfield. Question number five. This Greek goddess is portrayed as a winged goddess wielding a whip or a dagger. She is an avenger of crime who rides in a chariot pulled by griffins. Who is this goddess that was also adopted by the Romans as an imperial deity of retribution? Her name is Nemesis. Question number six. Her first novel, Alexander's Bridge, was published in 1912. Who is this American author whose novels are about life on the Great Plains and include O Pioneers, The Song of the Lark, My Antonia, and One of Ours, for which she won a Pulitzer Prize in 1923? The answer is Willa Cather. Question number seven. This substance is known for its use in creating perfume and fragrance. A solid, waxy, flammable substance, it is produced in the digestive tract of sperm whales. What is this fixative used by perfume makers? It is not used as much anymore, but it's still used. In some, it's called amber grease. Question number eight. The Rugrats cartoon premiered on Nickelodeon in 1991, and many episodes take place at the Pickles household. Who is the one-year-old baby whose playmates are Chucky, Phil, and Liz, and who has a baby brother named Dill and a dog named Spike?
The answer is Tommy. Tommy Pickles. Question number nine. This movie starred Robert Armstrong, Faye Ray, and Bruce Cabot. The female lead is kidnapped by a giant gorilla beast. Later in New York City, the beast scales the Empire State Building. What is this film that is ranked in the American Film Institute's sci-fi top 10 list? The answer is King Kong. Question number 10. A cousin to the reindeer, these mammals are the only successfully semi-domesticated deer on a large scale in the world. They are an important source of food, clothing, and shelter for Arctic people. What is this animal that is native to Northern Europe, Siberia, and North America? The animal we're looking for is the caribou. Question number 11. The Nintendo Entertainment System began with a limited test market in the US. The deluxe set was released in 1985 and 86 and included two game packs. One game used a robot attachment and another used a handheld weapon attachment. Name one or both of these games. The first one's easy. Duck Hunt used the handheld weapon and Gyromite was the other one. Question number 12. The name of this animal comes from a language spoken by Aboriginal people. This marsupial's unique digestive tract forms square cubes of dung, the only animal known to do this. What are these sturdy animals found throughout Australia that are also a protected species? The answer is the Wombat. Question number 13. Every episode of this original animated series contains a penultimate scene where the heroes unmask a seemingly supernatural antagonist to reveal a real person. What is this cartoon where the group of sleuths ride in the mystery machine van? The answer is Scooby-Doo. Question number 14. This fictional character is a dark-witted person from a powerful family. Because of his limited physical features, he is an embarrassment to his family. In the popular HBO series, what character's wit, humor, and cunning allowed him to survive and appear in more episodes than any other character? I believe he was in 67 of 73 episodes. Peter Dinklage's character was Tyrion Lannister. Question number 15. A keeper of cultural heritage in an institution concerned with tangible objects of some sort, such as artwork, collectibles, historic items, or scientific collections, what is the name of the content specialist charged with such an institution's collections? very elaborate way to ask who is in charge of a museum? The answer is the curator. Question number 16. Operational satellites refer to the man-made machinery put into orbit for communication, earth observation, science, technology, and navigation, just to name a few reasons. Which country currently has the most operational satellites? as of 2023. The answer is the United States. Question number 17. This actress was active in the Screen Actors Guild from 1935 to 1967. 
With numerous stage credits and 19 screen credits, some of the movies she appeared in are Ship of Fools, A Streetcar Named Desire, Gone with the Wind, Waterloo Bridge, and That Hamilton Woman. Name this actress. The answer is Vivian Lee. Question number 18. These are small files that websites put on your PC to store information about your preferences. What are these small blocks of data that can improve a user's browsing experience by remembering those preferences or by letting the user avoid signing in to certain sites each time? Those are called cookies. Question number 19. This female English novelist was known mainly for her six novels, which interpret, critique, and comment upon the British landed gentry. Her plots often explore the dependence of women on marriage for the pursuit of favorable social standing and economic security. Who is this author who never married? The answer is Jane Austen. And question 20. Released in 1974, this spy film was set in the 1973 energy crisis. This film also depicts the then popular martial arts phase. Based on a novel by Ian Fleming and produced by Albert Broccoli, what is this six word titled film that was the only six word titled film in the series? It was, of course, a James Bond movie, and it was The Man with the Golden Gun. All right, that is it for today. Thank you for watching today's episode of Road Trippia. Thank you to Carlene and Bill from Surf City, North Carolina, for sending us a great trivia quiz. Congratulations on living somewhere cool with a name like Surf City. I mean, you just can't have a cooler name for a town than that. I'm looking forward to your next quiz, which I believe pops up uh, sometime next week or shortly after that. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already and get ready. Here comes question 21, the tiebreaker for today. In 1983, Nintendo Entertainment System launched the Famicom computer in Japan. By the end of 1984, how many units were sold in the Japanese market? Whichever player gets closest to this number is going to win the point. The answer is 2.5 million units. Like I said, whichever player got closest to that, you don't have to be dead on, but whichever player got closest to that is going to win the point. And if it was a tie, they just won the whole game. Congratulations. Thank you for watching. See you tomorrow for day number 299.